you know, I keep saying go record this, and every time I do, I sleep in, which <laughs> doesn't end well for me or for you. Hey guys, I'm say here once more with Imperator Rome. Yes, we're back again. Things are getting interesting, aren't they? Yes, indeed. Um, I forget what I was doing. <laughs> oh, that was it. I was just waiting for aggressive expansions and so we need to sit down. So, last time, I remember, we took this lot. I can't remember if actually likes me, but I know I need a lot of culture changing going on. Oh boy. Oh boy, indeed. I need to change a lot of culture. All over the place. Like, I don't think there's many places... Yeah, um, but we are going to have downtime because I need to let this aggressive expansion tick down. <laughs> there are places that don't like me, <laughs> which is concerning. Uh, you're not ours, are you? Huh? Right, Velocassia. Right, so I remember it was mostly just like waiting on things. Because we were fiddling with things on Icenia itself. Oh, Icenia, yeah. On Britannia itself. Uh, where's... There it is. That's region. There it is. Because we were changing some of these around so we got rid of all barbarians like here, for instance. Which I think... Yes. Um, because what I was trying to go culture, barbarians, and then uh, trade. It's so like here's done, for instance, and I changed it up with benefit. Why didn't I change this? It would benefit slaves, but why didn't I go uh, encourage trade already? Probably there was a war going on or something. Um, it would benefit citizens here to do social mobility. Slaves. I can't afford it. Yeah, um... Like, I, I remember most things that went on last time. I don't know what happened here. Like, it's been a while since last recorded, I know that much. Why is the game loading so damn slowly all of a sudden? Hello, game! Yes, I know, I'm back! Did you miss me? Uh, game is running, right? What have I broken? Game. Game, please. Something is broken. There we go. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I think I'm just moving too much or something. I mean, I'm building a metric ton of thoughts. So probably it's trying to take everything over. What's this? Uh, you're gaining loyalty. I need to check in uh, provincial unrest. Yeah. Okay, um, it's not bad. Got quite a bit that's ticking up, even if it has got unrest. But as long as we, we should be fine, as long as we keep the homelands uh, fine. There is quite a lot of population over here, and these will just keep growing. And then once we get expanding further out, we'll actually get happier, 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 etc. Why is that unhappiness here? A polymath. I, I should know what that is, but I don't for some reason. I think it was you. Oh, that's that's really nice, actually. Minus one's well, I won't need some zeal anyway. What's this? Uh, cloth. No kid. Trying to influence someone for my points. Sure. All the trade in the world. Twenty-six gold. That's actually decent. Oh, now it is. <laughs> really? Wow, we lose that much. Christ. Um, I could lower taxes. No, I can't. <laughs> um, put this down and put that down. Because that does cost me, but unrest lower is slower. So, in some places, we'll actually take like some places is actually taken up because of that. So this is going to be a, uh, I suppose, quieter part because there's just not that much I can really do while having a high aggressive expansion. And we're lost at ultra reception. So 
I guess, go get your popcorn ready, go enjoy a movie, and we'll still be here when you come back. <laughs> I wish you'd die, but you're too young. You're 24. I wish you could abdicate. Pretty nice, actually, just abdication. I just. Hmm. Really? That doesn't sound like a good trade. Now, yeah, corruption's 28, that really does hurt. And it's actually going up every month. Ah, da -da -da. I'm going to go with. That one. Hey, more religious. Which we can't really do anything with in tech wise, but we can start a look. What do we get? Collegially? Oh, Shadow Cabinet. Reinterpreted Prodigies. <laughs> See, state religion happens to be very good for us because everything's juridic out here. And we follow juridic anyway. So getting that would actually help us out a ton, especially expanding around here. This place is isolated, so I think he gets a penalty for being isolated. No, it doesn't. Hmm. Um. Mm -hmm. I think I went to you for civic. Yeah, and then we'll grab that. And that should actually. Um, we'll do another influence. Uh, I would love to do it with you. Like, I don't mind using my uh, thing for that, but... Yeah, we're getting more ticks up. Nice. But this is going to help us out, because we do have, like, rebellion? No, rebellion. Yeah, rebellion issues. And we got to get them ticking down. Where's the bleed? Oh, you. Uh, we do have to keep an eye on this as well. Omens! What do we want? Um, Civ change would help over here. Because I believe we're still... Yeah, it's very low Civ over here. And it's going to help out further in as well. So... Uh, how are you looking? You have... I'm happy at that, so I'd be encouraging trade about actually that as tyranny. Great. Yeah, so we're changing anything here as tyranny. Yeah, alright. We'll come back to that next governor, I guess. But we have actually gotten decently far with that one. Oh, it's me, uh. Culturally unsound. Never thought to say that in my life. Things we are getting somewhere. Question is where? Ah. Huh? Oh, okay. Wait, do we just. Right. Because we only own this one. Yeah, because we're in here with its grain supplies. Hmm. So why are you so unhappy? Uh, gas expansion. And not Patani, which, very very not Patani, really does hurt. It's not really anything I can invest oratory into apart from changing these. And there's not really much of a point in changing these right now. We could go to war, but we haven't got the aggressive expansion for it. Get, like, the small gain out of it, but... Find a small gain in this mess. I do want to get some for the Eduia, or whatever these guys go, so we can actually get that corridor before the Romans come along. Wow.
Rome might be on the way for rebellion. Surprised he hadn't already got one. Fifteen eight seven. Looking up. Hey, he loses the press. Nice. Uh, fifteen eight seven needs eighteen twenty nine. Etruria is loyal. You see, apart from the Rebellion Wars, that's actually kind of interesting. Like it if you could just, like, cause issue without joining in, but that's, you know. Alright. Um. <laughs> wow, these also. I think it's got popularity. What's our popularity right now? I think we're spending it. Eh. What's the tick down of oh, this? It can actually go up. Like, it, it levels out soon. It's gonna be interesting. Oh, right. <clears throat> uh, you. And we shall put you here. Now I'll get further along. Uh, the governor of Germania. Oh no, actually I wasn't the governor. Because I was the aunt of you. Not very prominent, are you? Why is your prominence so low? You're in debt. Probably because this region isn't actually worth that much. Ah, feast wouldn't hurt. Yeah. No more wine, because we integrated them. Uh, welcome. Let's welcome them all. They did a great job for us. But now we have a new region. Bello Cassia is ours. But we'll take the tyranny here in order to establish cultural assimilation. Rome wants to trade. Drawing the eye or drawing their eyes, and we have another two more trade routes. Okay. Uh, wine would be good. It's free on happiness. Bring in some wood. Bella Cassia. So four band has a kid, nice. Yeah, I actually looks a, a lot neater now. Um, let's have a look at this just to be sure. Hello, I see one. It's worth doing even if it's just like six pops. Get started and come back to it later. And our tyranny really is not taking down that quick. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> the price of wild oats. A long way they saw the fair between Emperor Agus and the Emperor Child. Uh, lose money, gain tyranny. Lose legitimacy and stability. Close family members of I of guess me. Lose loyalty. Take the hit. Yeah, I know we're in debt. I'll we'll get fixed. I'll we'll get fixed. All the exports in the world. Things change with that. I could do. Um. I think it will do at this point. The more these actually encouraging cherry, the more money I make. Uh, you. You got mine. Match trade rich we have going. 
Oh, that's actually quite a nice breakdown. <laughs> Friend in need. That's a lot of cash, but fix the bills here. We're still positive. That's a good thing. Gotta keep that going for a bit. Well, let's actually get some more money coming in just so we don't have this coming up again. And you, when we get this tick, we'll actually get another import route set up. Import route, yeah, that's the word. Uh, set up here, and we'll assimilate a couple. Yeah, it'd be use of points. Potentially avoid issues. Huh. Okay. Fair. Uh, well, you have wood. I don't think I really want. I don't have internal. I'm guessing by each surplus, it does actually mean, you know, getting another 3% tax. Yes, it does. Nice. That's actually really neat. Remember that one? Yep. Red-handed, a the high priest and sister of the governor of Germania. We lose money. Come friends. Take the popularity. Oh, we already lost the money. Okay. Um. We can put down fort maintenance. Uh, okay. We already have put down fort maintenance. Things at this point is literally just way around. I know, thrilling. All this aggressive expansion, we can't do anything with it. Still, oh, that does look nice. When we get past here, which will be. 62. Nine years? Change that, can't I? Yeah, that'd be good. You got a shot. Hmm. Um, more civics. And we've got one. So, so why do we actually get more military expenses then? Nice. Nice. So these are actually quite good. This one, the thing is, experience drops off as you um, don't do anything. Like, it, it's. <laughs> Um, as the division fights, it gains experience, but it drops off as people die, air quotes. Like, people drift, uh, draft in and out of the army. Which I get, but at the same time, it's, you know. It's like, why have it as a thing that's not consistent? Like, discipline makes sense in uh, EU4. Because discipline, it's do these drills, remember these drills. And so on and so forth. You better train. And then when the fight happens, it's like, remember your training, we've got to get into recruits, that kind of thing. Here, it doesn't make that much sense. Uh, mm, uh, yeah, uh, 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 uh. Um, supply them. So that'll help our uh, heavy cohort as well. Hmm. That is a lot of income. My exports are worth, my exports are worth so much. I do like how this goes, though. Like, it's taken a bit. But I can see what this game was trying to be. I don't think I'm going to grow much more from where I am. Which is unfortunate, but I actually don't mind it that much, honestly. I've, got a lot, I've had a blast with this campaign. And if it does end in... 
60 odd years. It'll, it'll be worth it. I, I, I love this campaign. Like it's given me a chance to just like think things through. I've seen some weird stuff. <laughs> I've learned quite a bit just from how they handle things around here. Like how to deal with barbarians. Like that's something that I'll be sure to remember for future campaigns. And it's nice to have been able to play my homeland. Like I sound like a nationalist, but yeah, home. But I'm going to sort this out and go call that out. So, mm -hmm. yeah, anyways. Uh, next time, I don't know. <laughs> see what happens. It's probably another waiting game. I have to see what goes on because this has to tick down. I don't know how I'm going to do that. Not quickly, anyway. Um, the appealing stance is helping, which is annoying. I have to figure out something. I'll catch you next time, folks. Take care. Really, you got rid of that shortcut?